Here's a look into Tempe's Lost Our Home for St. Francis Feast Day. He started out in 2008. We, it was a grassroots response to a community issue when it came to pets and people in crisis. What makes us unique are our unique programs. We have a temporary care program. We even have a pet bank, food bank program here. And of course, we are standing by a kitten room. So we also have a um, intake and rescue program as well. Come on in. And so some of these kittens have come to us off the street. Some of them have come in to us from the, actually the Tempe police. And what's really different about Lost Our Home is we really want it to feel like a house and a home in here. So as you look at this kitten room, you're going to notice it kind of looks like a living room. We have decals on the wall here, uh, library books, things like that. It's a little bit more shy under the TV here. So the benefit of coming to a rescue is you really get to know these pets, their likes, their dislikes, their personalities. We can really advocate for the perfect home for them. So these um, are what in other shelters they call kennels, but we call them neighborhoods. So as you can see, they look like the outside of houses. We really wanted to make it feel like a home because here at Lost Our Home, we don't want people walking in here feeling like they're in a shelter. We want people to come in here and find their next family member. There are notes on here so that everybody knows a little bit about more about here. We need volunteers to come in and walk the dogs, but it's also important that the dogs, um, as you can hear, right, they get really anxious. Um, and so being able to get them out and socialize with them, socialize with them really helps them in their experience as well as get, helps us get to know them better so that we can help people understand their personalities better and it can get them adopted better. The library um, actually was renovated by one of our um, previous adopters. Our volunteers come in here and they socialize with the pets in this room. All of this food, it is from the community for the community. Um, and it's not just for the pets that we help here in the shelter. And so you can see all of this is for our food bank. Even treats, because every pet, no matter what is going on in the world, right, deserves to have food, deserves to have treats. We really couldn't do what we did for the community if it wasn't for the people coming together, helping us so that we can go back out and help other people and